We are now hearing from the father of the girl who says she was approached and flashed by a man in Osceola County. The suspect is still in the run. West Street's Marina Morocco reports the 12 year old victim is having a hard time after this incident. You know, you got a lot of people that walk in the morning. And, um, but I guess this guy did not, you know, that didn't phase him because, you know, he went for his attack. A flasher is on the prowl in Point Sienna. And then when my daughter, you know, looked at him, he was already exposed and, and touching himself. This man's 12 year old daughter says it was on her walk to school Tuesday morning that a man pulled up next to her and in seconds was exposed and touching himself. She's very sad. You know, I'm trying to keep her motivated, trying to keep her head up, you know. Uh, she feels a little ashamed that that had to happen to her as a young lady. As we spoke to the victim's father, Osceola County Sheriff's Office's chopper hovered over Monterey Road in Brighton Court, the same location where the Discovery Intermediate student said she was approached. Detectives released this composite sketch of the man they believe is behind the obscene antics. He's said to be in his 20s or 30s, bald with brown eyes and driving an older model green sedan with tinted windows. A very similar description to a past flasher in this same neighborhood just a few years ago. I mean, I don't got the words. I'm very angry. He did a lot of damage and, and one thing you don't do, you don't mess with my daughters, you know. Any information you have regarding this man that will lead to his arrest could be compensated with up to $1,000 in cash. In Osceola County, Marina Morocco, West 2 News.